Hey up folks, it's Farmer Dale here at Cannon Farm. I'm in with the ewes, the pregnant ewes. Uh, are all up at the roundhouse now. Everything that's going to lamb in February and also some that are going to lamb at Easter time are already indoors and we are preparing for lambing. Um, that includes keeping them nice and clean while they're up here. Now they're on a straw bed, it's a deep litter bed, so it's fairly deep, but when you do that, one of the things you've got to do is make sure that you keep it nice and clean and dry. And that means putting new straw in the pen every day. So that's what I'm gonna be doing today. Um, Farmer Dave has already tipped a load of straw in here with the JCB, which I'll show you. Just gently move the sheep about. Big nice pile of clean straw, which I've got to spread all around this mucky pen. It's something we do every day, completely necessary, but is one of the more manual jobs we do. Anyway, I'll crack on and uh, you can follow along. So thanks and let's get started. Right, so that's that one done. All done and dusted. Hopefully it's looking a lot cleaner than it did before. A lot drier and uh, a lot more comfortable for the sheep, which is the main thing. You might have noticed me using my tool of the trade, long-handed fork. It's the only thing that does the job properly. You can try messing around with other things, but um, that's the only thing that does the job right. So that's all done and dusted. I've, I've actually got another two or three pens to do. So I'll crack on and do them. You can uh, follow me around and uh, I'll talk to you at the end. So, um, one thing to note is about this job, and I, it's easy to forget this when you when you do it a lot, or when you've done it a lot, um, but is the quality of the straw. People at home, not all straw is equal at all. Now, luckily, the stuff we've got today is just about perfect. It's about a 10 out of 10, actually, in terms of uh, quality. So it's really, really nice and fluffy, nice and bright. It's not hard. Sometimes, depending on when it's being cut, where it's being cut, what, what crop's being used, and how long it's being stored, uh, you get varying qualities, and you sometimes get lumps of it, so it all sticks together, and it makes it really, really hard to use. Anyway, this stuff is absolutely perfect, so I'm loving knocking this around today. Uh, last pen to do, we're gonna do that now, and all these lot should be feeling much happier. Right folks, so there you go, hopefully all done and dusted, nice, clean and tidy for the next 24 hours. They will need some more again tomorrow, hopefully not quite as much, they're pretty mucky today. So that is how we go about bedding up and keeping these clean. Like I said, it is one of the more manual jobs. One thing to keep in mind is that we haven't started lambing yet. Once we start lambing, we need even more straw to keep on top of them being clean and that's because they do like to, uh, when they are giving birth, when they are getting ready to lamp, they like to dig up all the straw, they move around a lot and make a lot more mess. So, um, yeah, a little bit more straw to come in the next few weeks as we start lambing here at the farm. Very exciting. So, thanks for watching, guys. Just a quick working video of what we get up to here at the farm in the morning. We'll see you later. I'll see you. Goodbye from me and a goodbye for some very pregnant sheep. See you later, folks. Ta-ra.